up for my city. Yo, today is City to City here with Coach Mike Hunter, Friendship Collegiate Knights head coach. First of all, Coach, thank you for the time today. It's a pleasure as always. Uh, once again, thanks for allowing us at your um, your media day you had this past weekend. And first of all, we want to commend you for running a nice, well oil machine program up over there. Um, we just wanted to, you know, have you up here on here today, you know, tell us a little bit um, about some of your goals and some of the things that you have planned for this season. So if you can start off by telling us, like, what are some of your goals that you have for this season? Uh, I mean, the, the ultimate goal is to help all of our young men uh, get into college. So, you know, that, that's first and foremost. And then once we get to, you know, the playing field, obviously we're trying to go out and win every game. They're going to keep score. We're trying to win. Um, and, and, you know, that's culminated with winning the DCSAA championship in December. Uh, so those are some of the main goals that we try to focus on here, playing friendship, championship level football. Okay, now, now you see me, you see me in my attire today, coach. You know, y'all are known as the Knights. But y'all also known as the Beach Boys. Now y'all got a tradition up over there, friendship. How do y'all keep that uh, tradition alive? Uh, so the, the name Beach Boys started with uh, Bill, our old practice Bill, uh, which we used to have back up until the year 2021. You know, it was kind of dirt and sand and all that stuff. And it just, it created a mentality that it didn't matter where we came from, what we had, you know, we gonna bring our best every day. So we just always try to uh, keep that mentality, whether we playing on a nice turf field or playing on the beach. It's all about the mentality and, you know, we're going to bring it every day. Yeah, that, that's definitely a fact. Now, Coach, y'all y'all have some, some players that are and currently in college, currently in the pros. Um, do you use those um, as motivation for your current kids to, like, you know, push them and show them, hey, we, we got kids that have been in the same position that made it? Um, and is that used as a tool to have them kind of like buy into the system? Uh, it's definitely. I mean, it's no better uh, thing you can teach somebody just from experience that you've had. And, you know, we all have goals as young men and, and young women when we're growing up playing sports that we want to play at the highest level. And if we can show them examples of guys who came in this program before them, was reach those levels, whether it's playing college football or playing, you know, in some type of pro level, NFL, XFL, uh, those are good examples and show them that it can be done right here on Minnesota Avenue. You don't have to go to, you know, some of the schools that people think you have to go to. Because, uh, you know, I think our track record rivals any other school in the DMV. I can attest to that. I can attest to that. Now, I got one more question before we go, Coach. Uh, we were out there uh, at y'all media day. It's a lot of kids flying around out there. Can you highlight some of the student athletes that should be on our radar this year? Oh, uh, we got a lot of guys who, you know, did a good job last year. And I think a lot of guys will step up this year. Uh, starting with, you know, some of our team captains, Khalil Frazier, that linebacker. I think he's, he's due for another uh, excellent year. Uh, Freddie Simmons, our center. Uh, he's going to be a 40 year starter for us. Been doing a great job being the captain of the offensive line. Uh, the other guys, Bryce Jenkins, Dallas Miners, Diane Kennedy, um, Maurice Calloway, uh, Nick McCray, Damien. I think the list goes on and on. You know, I don't want to forget anybody, uh, you know, of course. Them out because I think, you know, we got so many talented guys who put in so much work. Uh, that I'm excited for this year, and I, I think it's going to turn out to be a pretty good year. Hey, we're excited about it, too. We're going to definitely come out and see a couple of y'all games. We have y'all on our schedule uh, quite a bit this year, so we're definitely trying to uh, see some of those names you just mentioned. Coach, continue to do a great job and remain a great leader for these kids out here. They definitely need it um, in these times, especially, um, you know, uh, motivational leaders um, to be in these kids' lives, as you know. Thank you, man. I appreciate the work that you guys do, because you all so highlight you know, our young men and young women, because we hear so much negative stuff about teenagers these days, and it's guys like you all who are putting a positive out there in the universe, and that's what they need to see. So we definitely appreciate you, and our doors are always open anytime you got one.
like this, that's all you're gonna do is step with that.